Due to some uh, current events, I want to shove some knowledge down your guys' cute throats over the history of the Ukraine. So buckle up, buttercups, because here's an episode of... Countries, Countries I, I found, found Cool. Ukraine is a nation that has had a rich and colorful history spanning centuries, but I am not here to talk about all that. I'm here to talk about the batshit stories that come from the land that was once the Kievan Rus. During the 8th, 9th, and 10th centuries, Vikings were known to rape and pillage throughout Eastern Europe. But one Viking decided to rebel like an alt by teen girl and forge an empire instead of killing one. And his name was Oleg of Novgorod. Now Oleg was your stereotypical Eastern European man, racist and bloodthirsty, and he decided that the city of Kiev was to be his. So he kinda did that, killed a couple of Slavs in the process, as a Viking does. <laughs> He also tried to do the cool and new hip trend of sacking Constantinople, but he ended up being stopped by the age-old enemy of all Vikings. Big Walls. Now, Ukraine is still a relatively new country, coming into being after the dissolution of the Soviet Union. After the Soviets fell in the 1990s, they ended up in a strange situation as they now had the possession of 3,000 nuclear warheads. And as always, an Eastern European with weapons of mass destruction gave no country anywhere in the world any sort of panic. I'm just kidding, everyone panicked. They were forced pretty unilaterally to return the nukes to Russia, like a little kid being forced to give a loaded gun back to their dad. And like an abusive dad promising his son not to hit mom again, Russia promised to respect the territorial integrity of the Ukraine. And this was recognized and protected by everyone. Wait a minute, where have I heard that before? Now the moral of the story is that Vikings are better conquerors than pillagers, and that Russia is a country to be trusted on all matters relating to foreign and internal affairs. Thanks for watching. I have a Discord server by the way.